Violent protests flared in Ferguson, Missouri Monday night after a grand jury declined to indict a white police officer in the shooting of an unarmed black teenager. Within hours of decision, police were using smoke canisters, tear gas, and a non-lethal shotgun rounds to disperse crowds. Incidents of looting and buildings being set on fire were also reported. Violent protests were also staged in cities from New York to Oakland, California. The grand jury was charged with determining whether a crime occurred in Ferguson when police officer Darren Wilson shot 18-year-old Michael Brown in August after an altercation. They determined that no probable cause exists to file any charge against Officer Wilson and returned a no true bill on each of the five indictments. The family and Mr. Brown said they were profoundly disappointed by the grand jury ruling. They added in a written statement that answering violence with violence is not the appropriate reaction. Leslie McSpadden, Mr. Brown's mother, also addressed the crowd outside Ferguson Police Headquarters following the grand jury announcement. The shooting has become a national flashpoint on race, justice, and policing and started a national debate over the treatment of young black men by police.